Your pressure is above 140 over 90 millimeters per mercury. That your pressure is above the normal and you need treatment. I'm going to tell you something that will change your mind when you look at a person with high blood pressure. When a person measures his blood pressure and you chart it over 24 hours, you'll be surprised that our pressure actually changes all the time. It goes up one moment, it comes down one moment. Generally, the normal people will have what we call a dipper pattern. What it means is that the blood pressure in the day will fluctuate, but it is within the normal range. But by the night, when you're going to sleep, the blood pressure will drop 10 to 15 percent. The moment you start to wake up at the daybreak when the sun rises, our blood pressure slowly goes up another 10 to 15 percent. And we have what we call a dipper pattern. But there are a number of us walking around with abnormal patterns. There are few types of patterns that are actually fairly dangerous. One of which is called night high. Night high is when a person's blood pressure is normal during the day, but when you start to go to bed and when you sleep, your pressure goes up and your pressure can be really high at night. But you are sleeping, you don't even know about it. Why is it so important to catch the night high? It's because people with night high have three to five times the risk of having a stroke. There's another group of patients, what we call white coat, referring to the white coat of the doctor. What I mean by that is when they see a doctor in the clinic, the pressure goes up for obvious reason. You get nervous, you don't know what the doctor is going to do to you. Your pressure goes up. So every time he measures your blood pressure, you are high. But when you measure your blood pressure at home, it's not high, you're normal. One in four to one in five people who are having hypertension do not need treatment and they are given treatment. In fact, in the study done, published in 2005, that is from Dublin Outcome Study, a very significant study because they tracked 5,200 over patients for a period of average of 8.4 years. They put all these patients on 24-hour blood pressure and when the paper was published, it sent shockwave across the medical circle because what they found was number one, the night pressure is the most telling and the most sensitive in predicting death rate. For every 10 millimeter rise in the night pressure, you have a 21% rise in death rate. For a 10 millimeter rise in the average 24 hour pressure, your death rate increases by 19% versus 2% death rate increase when you measure the clinic blood pressure and when you rise by 10 millimeter. It is indispensable but it's very hard to do. Why? Because the traditional blood pressure 24 hour monitoring is a cuff base. Can you imagine that you are going to sleep and just about going to doze off to sleep and the machine pumps at you and that is not very comfortable despite you know its advancement. You know you can get rashes you can get bruises, you cannot bathe, you cannot go out, you disrupt your life. B-Pro is an invention which we want to bring up to the world because of two technology. One, it captures your blood pressure without even you knowing it. It is a new method of measuring blood pressure. We measure it by capturing the pulse wave at the wrist using the arterial waveform which is a brand new method which we do not have to use cuff. The second thing about B-Pro is that not only it captures the 24-hour pattern, it also studies your arterial waveform which means it can tell you whether your vessels are hardened, whether your vessels are stiff and whether you're going to be likely to get a stroke or a heart attack. Now B-Pro, it is the only device in the world that can do both. 24-hour blood pressure pattern and heart rate pattern and the microscopic 
arterial waveform analysis. Now all you need to do is put it on, calibrate and come back in 24 hours time and have the result uploaded every 45 minutes in Singapore. We have one stroke admitted to the hospital. For every three to four hours, we have one heart attack in Singapore. By using B-Pro, you are three steps ahead and you want to make sure that you can pick up the high-risk group of patients who have not had a stroke, who don't even have problems, who doesn't even complain, who doesn't even have symptoms, like you and me walking around. Definitely the way to go is evidence-based medicine. And B-Pro is the one that can help you to do evidence-based medicine.